So what is up guys, Isaiah here and we are back in the camp with another Jurassic Lucky video and for today's video we are going to talk about the new incoming dinosaur what is it called? Let me wait, let me Dilophosaurus. Dilophosaurus, okay. I don't know how to pronounce it, but anyway, let's get started. So the Dilophosaurus is a genus of theropod that um, roam in state of Arizona from like 180 million years to 200 million years. And if you guys what or don't don't know what this theropod is, so theropod is the dinosaur that could be beast footed, just like this. Um, Scorpius, as you can see that he has two legs and small hand just like the T-Rex, Gigantosaurus, and Velociraptor, and etc. So the Dilophosaurus is actually OP that he can spit a venom that makes their prey paralyzed and poisoned. So that is a good thing for the Dilophosaurus, yeah? And so how the Dilophosaurus um gonna work and you know in jurassic lucky so here is the prediction so you guys won't you know um freak out just like oh no this dinosaur is gonna be or gonna be op or something like that but no so if you guys all know that all of the dinosaurs over here that have a passive so this dinosaur the hybrid one has two but the Dilophosaurus is just like the original dinosaur that we have over here. So this dinosaur has a poison just like just like this a Scorpius Rex. So since the Dilop the Dilophosaurus Dilophosaurus has a poison and it can make the it can make his prey paralyzed and poisoned. So it's his passive will be a poison and also it will slow or paralyze the enemy that he he was fighting in the game so what is the size of Dilophosaurus right so over here I'm I'm checking the Jurassic World Wikipedia and I'm checking the size of the Dilophosaurus right so the size of the Dilophosaurus. First, we have the height. We have the 5.2 feet of the Dilophosaurus. And the length of the Dilophosaurus is 3 meters, which is 9.8 feet. And for the weight of the Dilophosaurus, we have the 300 kg, which is 600, 661.4 lbs. And yeah, so that is the bio for the Dilophosaurus. So actually we have the Dilophosaurus over here, but this is not a new dinosaur. I'm sorry for the statement earlier, but this is a reanimated um, dinosaur model that they are working on. So I'm going to show you the clip about the Dilophosaurus that they just reanimate. Here we go. So I wanted to show you guys the reanimation for the Dilophosaurus and as you can see that they made that animation pretty smooth and we can tell that they really put a time making that reanimation for the roar so that's not a attack and that not a roar just I mean that's not an attack just a roar so if you guys want to make the Dilophosaurus more OP or more real reliable Oh, I'm sorry. Re reliable on the game. You guys should ask the owner to change the Dilophosaurus to more reliable and OP dinosaur. 
and yeah. So now let's talk about the Indominus Rex. So the Indominus Rex is not done yet, I think, because they are still um, using the old Indominus Rex, but we can wait about the new incoming model for the Indominus Rex. And I'm gonna tell you guys some news about the Indominus Rex if they did post this on their um, development in their Discord. So, so what should we expect on their Indominus Rex? So Indominus Rex is actually OP that he can kill T-Rex and also some of the Velociraptors. And without Mosa, Mosasaurus, if you guys watch the movie um, Jurassic, Jurassic World, they can defeat the Indominus Rex. But with help, also with help of the Velociraptors, they can manage to kill the Indominus Rex. So actually the Indominus Rex is stronger than T-Rex and the Velociraptors are just like the minions of the T-Rex. So the Indominus Rex might have a tree passive and also I think the passive that he will have is the uh, camouflage and the health and also the um, intelligence that they have because they fooled the people or the humans in Jurassic World and I hope they do something about the intelligence that Indominus Rex has and maybe the passive that he will have is just like the T-Rex passive the what's it called when you when your health becomes 50 percent less and you will have a double damage or extra damage and also a knockback and if you guys got hit just like a pato you guys know the apato the long leg dinosaur if you guys use that you will have a knockback just like also the spinosaurus and yeah i hope he has the um resistance it's like the other dinosaur over here the other dinosaur over here yeah they have a knockback resistance just like 50 percent and yeah so that's all for the news for the indomit rex and i'm gonna post this i'm gonna post it on youtube if they have a use for indominus rex and yeah so what do you guys think about the reanimation and the indominus rex news that is um coming in youtube that i'm posting today and yeah and i hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you guys enjoyed the video please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe for more graphic vloggy video anyway thank you guys for watching and make sure to subscribe and like the video and goodbye